like one of the most exciting talents of Girona and La Liga, Savio, will play for Manchester City next season. In this video, Fanatico will tell you all about this incredible Brazilian and the match that made Pep buy him. So, subscribe to us and let's get started! Savio is a Brazilian, which means that he runs football at a hard level because of the crazy competition. In Brazil, every other boy dreams of making a career in football. So, in order to break through, you need to have something special. Savio was born in 2004 and started his career at Atletico Mineiro, which he joined in 2018. The winger progressed quite quickly, and after three years in the academy, he was promoted to the first team. He didn't stay there long either. Within one year, Savio played 27 matches and scored only two goals. Nevertheless, his talent was obvious, and in the summer of 2022, Atletico Mineiro announced a transfer agreement with City Football Group for 6.5 million euros plus 6 million in bonuses. It's clear that when signing with City Football Group, every player is motivated by the prospect of playing for Manchester City. However, at that time, 18-year-old Savio was still to go through this journey. It was decided that the Brazilian would join the French Liga 1 club Troyes. But here's a little spoiler. Savio never played a single match for Troyes and will not play. Apparently, the club decided that Liga 1 would be too difficult for the young Brazilian, primarily physically. So, for the 2022-23 season, he was loaned out to PSV. The season in Eredivisie was supposed to help Savio adapt to European football and get some playing time. As it turned out, life in Europe required some adjusting. In terms of his playing time, the loan to PSV was a failure. He featured only in 8 matches during the season and none from the first minute. Nevertheless, Savio managed to make 2 assists in these matches. However, he mostly played for the youth team of the Dutch giant. It's worth mentioning that in the middle of that season, Savio suffered a hamstring injury that put him out of action for two and a half months. Such things, especially at a young age, throw a footballer out of rhythm. So this loan could have turned out quite differently. Interestingly, having played only a few dozen matches at the senior level, Savio managed to win four trophies, the Brazilian League and Cup with Mineiro, as well as the Dutch Cup and Super Cup with PSV. Last summer, Savio returned to Troyes, which was relegated to Liga 2. This time, City Football Group did not keep the Brazilian in France because they wanted him to play football at the highest level. So the winger joined Girona, another consortium club. What happened next is a story that is being written before our eyes. Who would have thought that Girona would fight for the title? Who would have thought that a young Brazilian with almost no experience in senior football would become one of the leaders of this amazing team? That's how a series of coincidences give us one of the most exciting stories of this season. Like the video if you're enjoying Girona and Savia's journey this season and wish them to create a sensation. So, who is this player that the strongest team in the world wants to have? Well, Savio is a Brazilian winger, and his main attributes are dribbling and technique. It's a typical story, but there are significant differences. What makes him different from other compatriots is that he doesn't overuse these skills. Savio understands very well when to take on the opponent and when it's better to pass. This is rare for young Brazilians. We can recall Vinicius, who was constantly trying to beat the opponent losing the ball and was very inefficient. It took him a few years at Real Madrid to get rid of that and reach the level we see him at now. Savio is currently 19 years old and he seems to have speed ran this stage. The guy can hardly be called a classic Brazilian winger because he doesn't try to keep the ball in his feet and fully control it. Realizing his speed advantage, Savio likes to just flick the ball past the opponent and cover space as quickly as possible. A classic move for him is a body fiend with a pass to throw the opponent off the balance and then flicking the ball down the wing and heating up the game. This is of great benefit to Girona, as it allows them to maintain the dynamics and pace of their attacks. Another advantage of Savio is his crosses. He has an excellent medium and long pass. In Girona, the Brazilian most often plays as a left winger, and given that he is left-footed, these allowed him to improve his passing quite a bit. Savio feels quite natural as a left winger, 
Although inverted wingers are much more common in modern football, the left-footed Savio plays very well on the left. This, by the way, is a great experience and will only help him in the future, even if he's later transferred to the right wing. Savio is perfectly balanced and agile. He stands on his feet strongly and because of this, it is quite difficult to stop him without a foul. Another atypical characteristic of this young winger is his vision and understanding of the game. He can be called a playmaking winger. It's very annoying to face a player who can create a goal-scoring chance from any position. Savio should be praised for his discipline, which also sets him apart from his compatriots. His off-ball play is impressive, and the work of Girona coach Michel should be praised here. Of course, a club from the middle of the table will not be able to compete for the title without a clear system of play, and Savio hit the jackpot on a personal level by joining Michel at the beginning of his career. The Brazilian also has a good shot and can perform set pieces. Savio has solid natural attributes and stamina, which means he will be able to withstand the high-intensity football of Pep Guardiola and the Premier League. In total, Savio has 7 goals and 7 assists in 27 matches this season. By the way, no one in La Liga has more assists and take-ons than this Brazilian winger. A brilliant start to his career. Of course, Savio has been playing at a high level throughout the season, but there was one match that probably made Guardiola think, I need this guy. We refer to the La Liga match against Mallorca on September 23rd last year. That game ended in a 5-3 win for Girona, and Savio was the main man on the pitch. Not only did he score a goal and provide an assist, he was excellent in every aspect of the game. The Brazilian made three shots, three key passes, and created two big chances. In addition, he had two out of three successful dribbles, one tackle, and five out of six duels won. For this performance, all the leading stats platforms awarded Savio with over 9 points for this game. It was only the beginning of the campaign, and back then Girona and the Brazilian were not considered to be the season sensation. So, it was the match against Mallorca when Savio announced to the whole world, I have arrived. Another turning point was the match against Barcelona, when the Brazilian destroyed Jules Conde on the wing, and Girona beat the opponent 4-2 away from home. After this performance, it became obvious that he would not stay in Girona for long. Fabrizio Romano reported that City agreed on a summer transfer for Savio. Of course, this is a too loud statement, because Girona, Troyes, and Manchester City belong to the same group of clubs. Therefore, it'd be more appropriate to say that the Brazilian is moving to a new level. The highest possible. Leroy Sané, repackaged, 9 years younger, with a Brazilian passport. So many similarities between Girona Savio and Schalke Sané. Pep Guardiola definitely has a type. This signing always seemed inevitable. This is the kind of opinion you can find on Twitter. Now, imagine Man City's attack next season. Holland, De Bruyne, Foden, Alvarez, Doku, Grealish, Bernardo, with Young, Echeverri and Savio added by Pep. Oh wow! It looks like someone will have to give up their place and make way for a new generation. So far, it looks like Jack Grealish may be the one to go, as he lost his place in the starting lineup this season. Bernardo Silva may also leave City, so Foden, Doku, Alvarez and Savio will compete for four places in the wings. And this is going to be exciting. I have the objective of playing for Manchester City. If one day I get to Man City, you can be sure that I've done things well at Girona, as I'm doing now, Savio said at the start of the season. Six months later, his dream has come true. Friends, write in the comments whether you believe that Savio will become a world football superstar at Manchester City. Fanatico channel was there for you. We'll love football as much as you do. Check out our other videos and take care. Bye-bye.